Hi guys, we're here to test three centrifugal juicers here versus the Omega BMJ330, Revel JE98XL, Kubings NJ9500U versus the Omega. Let me introduce a little bit about the specs. Parts is the three inch mount, speed is at 11,000 RPM which, with only one speed. Motor is at 350 watt, half a horsepower, dimension is 12.5 by 15 and 8. The weight is about 16 pounds, warranty is for 10 years with one year warranty on the blade itself. Uh, the safety mechanism is very important we got here. Uh, you need to make sure it's latched on in order to operate your machine. Price is at $199, it is the most expensive one out there here, but they are technically manufactured for commercial use. Breville here is, has two speed, low is 6500 RPM. Uh, high is 12,000 RPM, which is the highest among the three. The motor with the strongest motor, 850 watt. Dimension is 13 by 2 by 16.5 by 18.2. Weight is at 13 pounds, and the warranty is for one year for all parts. Safety locking is, it, is this part right here, which you need to have it on properly in order to operate your system. The price is at $149.95. And lastly, Kubings here, uh, the parts with the 3 inch mouth uh, speed, it also has 2 speed. Uh, the low speed is at 9500 RPM and the turbo is 11,000 RPM. The motor is 350 watt, dimension is 6.5 by 17 and 9.6. Uh, the weight here is the lightest among the three, it is at 9 pounds. Uh, warranty on this guy is Warranty on this guy is five years on the motor, one year on the parts. Safety lock, lock mechanism is this part right here, which you need it on properly in order to operate. The price is at $149. And now we are going to test the three products and see which product produced the, the best juice and how much they will bring to us. We're going to compare the three juicers using Fuji apples today. Uh, the Fuji apples are cut in four pieces through, through the center. Um, the stems and the middle part are cut out for extra cleanliness. And the seeds are left inside for the machine to do the work and maybe we could get some nutrient out of them. So we're going to weigh each bowl and make sure they're getting the same amount of apple. It's at 1,024 grams which converts into 2 pounds. This one is also at 1,024 grams. And last bowl is at 1,024 grams. And now we get to start the juice off. We're going to start off with the Omega. Um, these apples, uh, these guys are soft fruits, okay? Uh, they, they should be used for low speed to get uh, better, better juice out of it uh, with, with less friction and heat buildup. Um, the Kubings and Breville do have two speed, uh, which has the low speed for the fruits that are soft. Omega actually only have the high speed, uh, only one option. So in order to do a fair comparison, we're going to do at high speed for all three products to make sure uh, we are fair with all the brands. So to get started with the Omega, I'm gonna insert one at a time. Make sure to do the pumping motion because you want to allow the juicer to get that momentum and the speed build up in order to do a proper juicing. Run for a couple seconds. Turn 
it off. I'm gonna do a tilt for a couple seconds to get the last bit of the juice. And then we're going to let it sit. Let's move on to Breville here. Breville's high speed is at 12,000 RPM, so it is going to be a little bit faster. And as the uh, 850 watt, so it should be much smoother. See how little pumping I need to do for these guys? The motor is doing very much all the work and it's working at very high speed. Kuvings, put it on turbo. couple seconds and see what we got so we let the juice uh, sit for about five minutes to actually see the very clear fine line between the juice and the pulp uh, if you look closer you will see the defining lines here we got the juice at the bottom that are uh, somewhat clear and then the middle there is somewhat a uh, gray brownish line of layer that is the pulp and the very top is the, the, the foam itself and some little bit of combination of pulp with that. So that is the layer. If you compare uh, Breville here, um, you see the brown line through the middle. There is a clear juice and the, the, the foam at the top. If you look at Kuvings here, uh, if you could see the very... Kuvings actually have very little uh, pulp here. Uh, and somewhat uh, a foam at the top here. Uh, I actually did a review on carrots on these guys. They show significant uh, differences among carrots, so check that video out. Now we're going to strain these guys and actually check out what the actual uh, juice we have collected from each guy. So let's start off with the kuvings here. Pour into the same cup here. And you see the dropping of the foam. I'll let that one sit. Let's move on to Breville. And lastly, Omega. Turn that nozzle here. And we're going 
to let it sit for a couple minutes and get the actual amount of juice. So we let these guys sit for about five minutes. Uh, I need to point out that these are apples. Uh, they are soft fruits, so the pulp is very uh, fine. And the foams are here, so a lot of the foam and the pulp actually seep through the mesh here of the strainer. Um, but you can actually see the defining line of the juice, okay? Uh, um, uh, Kuvings here has very dark juice. That means it is clear. There's less uh, pulp in the juice itself. Uh, let's show the amount of pulp here. Uh, these guys are mainly foams for all three products. So this is at about 525 milliliter. And now to Breville, we have about 500 milliliter of juice. And lastly, Omega, which also have about 500 milliliters. So these three juicers are producing about the same amount of juice. Um, so it is somewhat the, the very tiny details of the consistency and the fineness of the juice. Um, if you prefer a little bit of pulp, uh, I think these three products, uh, there should be any comparison. Um, I think they're all great. Um, also need to point out that Omegas are stainless steel as well as Kuvings. That's the main difference between the Breville. Breville had the a 150 watt of motor and uh, it is running at 12,000 RPM, okay? So that is the big difference among the three. Uh, they have excellent warranty among the three products. Omega has been around for, for many years, so they have the credentials. They know what the customers want. And Kuvings have shown a very consistent result with the pulp uh, throughout the test we have done. So that, that's also good with the Kuvings, okay? They are very reliable on their juice. So these three products are excellent, especially for softer fruits. Um, I need, as I've mentioned, make sure to run it at low speed if you have the option, such as Breville and Kuvings, because you will, you will get better juice out of that at lower speed. So that's what we have here, and the, the result we have, you have seen. So uh, make your decision, see what you like. Um, I mean, these three products are designed different, they look different, uh, they have slight differences. So uh, you need to make the decision uh, which is the better juicer for you. And thank you for watching.